What's up guys, this is iOS Pro and today Apple has released iOS 14 Beta 6 to all developers today Came out 431 megabytes on my iPhone XR On my iPhone 11 I installed it Build number is 18A5357E And there are about 4-5 to five changes that I'm going to share with you guys today So let's get started Okay, the first changes at the bottom here of the Settings app. So when you scroll down here, you'll notice that some of the icons have been rearranged. So on Beta 5 here, you know notice Maps, Compass, and Measure, Safari, News, and the other apps here. But some of these have been rearranged. Like the Maps have been replaced with Safari. And then the News and Stocks were at the bottom. They've been moved up to go below Safari, FaceTime and Safari. The train, same for Translate up here. And now the Maps used to be up here underneath FaceTime. And now that's moved to under translate. And then the compass and measure have moved downward below that where, where the stocks and translate used to be. And then the health and shortcuts settings here have been switched. So better icon rearrangement. So really cool. Apple. Okay, this next one is when entering the reminder setting app settings here. So this is also in beta 5 here. So previously, when you click it here, here is very cool sound. It's hard here. Oh, let me put it to my mic here. You guys can hear it clicks a little bit. But the sound has been lowered on beta 6. You guys can you guys can hear that? So the sound has been lowered just a little bit on beta 6, so beta 5. Let me put up to my mic here. That's the beta 5, now beta 6. You see the, the click sound has been lowered a little bit, so it's very hard to hear it, but it has a click sound. We enter in the minor settings here, but this is also a bit of five, but did, Apple does lower the sound volume a little bit, so it's a little bit quieter, so. Very in interesting little change here, Apple. Okay, this next change is in the control center here. So previously on beta five here, you notice that the icon, battery percentage icon was raised a little bit. It was like above the battery status icon right here. But now on beta six, they've lowered it. So you guys see on beta five on the left, it's raised, but on beta six, they lowered it. It's very hard to notice it, but if you look at the slash and percent icon, you'll notice it. You see on beta 5, it was raised. Beta 6, they've lowered the whole status bar and the status bar battery icon. So, really, really cool change here, Apple. Okay, this next one is also in the control center. So, previously, if you looked on beta 5 here, you notice the icon for night shift and true tone were bold. The color of the icon was bold as well. When they're turned off to the, to the white icon there, it was bold in beta 5, same for true tone. But now on beta 6, you can see app is no longer bold, it's a little bit thinner now. So beta 5 on the left, beta 6 on the right. You guys can see it's very hard to notice it, but the nice shift icon and the true tone are not as bold now. They made it a little bit thinner now. So you guys see if you look at the little little edges around the icon the nice shift, like the part sticking out, you guys see those have been shrunk as well and made thinner. Same for the true tone icon. It's been made a little darker, a little bit darker now, and it's a little bit thinner, thinner as well on beta 6. So Really cool change, Apple. And it's very hard to spot it, but it is there. Okay, this last changes is in sounds and haptics. So if you look at beta five here, look at the volume adjuster. If you look at the icon on the left here in the adjuster, you notice that the adjuster is raised a little bit above the icon. It's not very center. But if you look at beta six, it's now centered. It's very, very hard to see it. But if you look at beta five on the left, it's raised. But on beta six, they've they centered the volume adjuster. They moved it downward. So it's very hard to spot, but it is there. So you guys can see it. Beta 5 is up a little bit. Beta 6 is now center. So it's no, it's only noticeable. So look over here on this icon. So that's a really cool change. A very hard to spot as well. So that's pretty much all the changes I could find for right now in this update. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.